this is your girl at Dark Tone. So today I am coming with a topic that I was actually having a very deep conversation with someone about and I just felt like it was a need for other people to know about it and to understand that this is something that's going on, something that's not going to stop, and something that you're seeing constantly every single day. So I feel like you should be aware of it. And the question that they asked me was, would you date someone with an STD? Okay. Instantly, I went back to when I was 18, 19, when I was younger. I'm 25 now. But I instantly went back there and just start thinking about my thought process then. It would have immediately been, no, I don't have time for that. Why would I waste my time with trying to get to know somebody like that? Oh, no, they must have did something nasty. Or, you know, like always thinking, oh, no, this has to be on this person's fault. Or, you know, it's just always making it seem like I was above it or I was too good for it. You know, but now at the age that I am now at 25 with meeting the type of people I meet and I work in customer service. So you meet a lot of different people and um, you just the, I feel like the older you get, you have the tendency of understanding more if you're developing. Right. But you have the tendency of understanding people's situations and trying to understand where they're coming from and how they're feeling. And now at the age that I am at, I would date somebody with an STD because you can date all these people without an STD and they can still treat you like crap. It, it doesn't mean like if you're dating someone with an STD, like that's going to be the worst relationship you've ever been in your life. No, you might find that it's one of the best relationships because the person has already been through enough bull crap and they're trying to get it straight, you know, so they'll have... A better sense of what a relationship really should be if they caught the STD and learned a lesson from it. Now, I wouldn't date someone with the STD if they're not honest. One thing I learned about, well, one thing I am starting to learn about a lot of people is that we hide anything and everything that we feel that people are going to look down on us about like anything that you feel like somebody might not agree with or think oh she's weird or oh my god no I don't want to be around her we have a tendency of trying to hold that in you know just like to the last straw I feel like no you know come right out the gate I feel like a real person that has a real heart and is a real loving and caring person just you being honest with them and telling them the truth number one they're going to have amount of respect for you already you know because it's not something easy to do and number two if the relationship grows you already set the foundation to let them know you know how to be honest you know how to communicate you know how to express how you feel you know so <laughs> i wouldn't knock anybody um somebody can knock me for numerous reasons you know so yes i would date someone with the std and i would get to know someone if we had the chemistry you know if i was really into this guy getting to know him and then maybe a month down the line before we have sex he comes out and let me know Wutu, woo, i have this and Wutu, i still want to get to know you if you're really laying that out on the line and giving my body in mind respects so you're respecting my body by telling me that you're respecting who I